As Professor David Kaiser of MIT explains, the word nuclear for some has come to have negative connotations. Words can be very um, tricky. And so uh, nuclear research very rapidly became uh, taken up with and then associated with uh, weapons, nuclear weapons. Uh, for quite understandable reasons, and that was in, indeed uh, one of the most uh, early and dramatic demonstrations of our of of our knowledge of nuclear forces and what holds the the, uh, the nuclei together. In the very early years after World War II, especially in the United States, all things nuclear were often seen in a very positive light. It was seen that these weapons had had a dramatic impact on the course of the war. And then when the extent of uh, some of these weapons became clearer, or the weapons themselves grew in uh, far greater destructive power, to things like a greater appreciation for radioactive fallout, all kinds of, of problems with these kinds of devices, then the word nuclear began to have actually quite a negative connotation, understandably. And uh, un the word nuclear applies to many types of things, and so people who were not working on weapons per se have had to contend with the connotations of the word nuclear, again, for good or for ill, for many years. So nuclear power for uh, civilian energy production, uh, still very controversial.